Hello Internet, happy Sunday, I hope you're having an awesome day. I felt like playing a little bit more Singularity, so let's continue where we left off. Um, Where was that? The crater is sinking and Dimitrov's men have the cargo hold surrounded. You're out of time, Captain! Not yet! Get the bomb, Renko! I'll hold them off long enough for you to escape! Okay, that was a uh, convenient little bit of dialogue. Okay, yeah, so I, I am trying to retrieve the E-99 bomb from the Black Pearl, or whatever the ship's called. Uh, when, then we're going to use the E-99 bomb to close the singularity and restore the correct version of history. So, I think I've got the bomb in my last video, I think. So, I'm going to try to escape while Catherine holds off uh, the bad guys. Uh, is it down here? Ooh, uh, how, do I, how do I go down? Oh, I just point myself, okay. Nope, looks like you can't go in down there. So why does it look like you can? This is one of my bugbears in games. Invisible walls. Ah, bad, bad, bad. Okay, so is it that way or is that way, is it? I don't... Oh, I'm about to run out of air. I need to get up and take a breath. Too much ranting about invisible walls. Interesting... Interesting. Why? What? Why can't I go along there? It looks like there's like a ledge just under the under the water surface. I should be able to jump on that. So as I was about to set, what? What? Okay, that's not an invisible wall. That is actually some cargo under the water surface, but I still can't go through there. Uh, as I as I was saying before, I started ranting about invisible walls. One of the, the things about this area is that the footprints... Oh, the footprints do work. Hmm. The footprints tell you to go so... What the heck? Okay, okay, okay. So why can't... Why can't I swim through there when there is so much space? Oh, boy. Uh... I'm actually going to drown down here because I've got myself into this alcove and I can't get out. Oh, phew, I'm out. Uh, okay, so where do I have to go? I mean, the game tells me I have to go that way. But there just doesn't seem to be a way through there. I'm pressing W and he's not going through, presumably because of these tidy little bits of whatever they are up there. So let's try going this way instead. Uh, I do like the water effects in this game. They look very watery. It won't let me go through there either. I am pressing W. Nothing is happening. Hear that tapping? That's me pressing W. Oh, no, that's 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 a different direction. Okay. Oh uh, boy, I am completely lost. I hate it when the games make me feel lost. Okay, can't, can't get through there. Uh, I can come along here. Hmm. Right, I can get back through here. Ooh, pretty plant. Is it going to attack me? Nope. That's good. Good plant. You don't want you attacking me. Right. Now where am I? Uh, I am somewhere. Ooh, something down there. Ooh. Oh, I hadn't got the bomb then. <laughs> Or my save game didn't remember that I had the bomb. I'm sure I got this last time. I could have sworn I did. I remember seeing it close up like that. Why wouldn't there be a checkpoint after you get the bomb? What kind of... Whoa. Okay. What kind of sense does that make? Damn, I didn't want to be down on things today. I was looking forward to a nice, cheerful game of Singularity because there's a lot about this game that I actually like. Okay, so I've got the bomb. I can loot this chest. Excellent, excellent. Loot is good. Right, and I have to go this way. I have a shiver in my chambers, matey. There's water everywhere. Uh, that was like the worst pirate voice ever, wasn't it? Ooh, the ship is coming apart. The ship is falling to pieces. 
Uh, nope, nothing down there. Am I still going the right way? Yes, I'm going the right way. Do, 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 do. Nobody to shoot. Oh, dear. We're sinking. Okay. Okay, I need to hurry through here, don't I, obviously. Can I swim any faster than this? Doesn't look like I can. Uh, oh, cutscene. Was that a cutscene? Yeah, it's a cutscene. I'm not doing this. Oh, it's Barisov. Hey, Barry. Oh, give it, Paul. Use your 90 year old muscles. Captain Renko. Seriously, Thank how old heavens are you? Right. Here, let me help you. You did it. You got the E99 bomb. We still have hope. I still don't get how anything I'm doing is anything he couldn't have done before I came along. You know, apart from saving his life. E99 processing complex. October the somethings. Bubble, bubble, toil and trouble, fire burn and cauldron bubble. Okay, that's what we've got here. Uh, ammo, which I can't pick up. A weapon locker, health pack, yum, yum, yum. A teddy bear. It's morning. Time to visit a friend. Why is a teddy bear in Russia talking English? Do I have any uh, upgrades to spend? No. Oh, I will keep my minigun and a sniper rifle because I like both of them. Wishing I could carry more than two weapons, I have to say. Ah, good. E99. I regret to inform you that Catherine will. I tried to stop her at the dock. Oh but no. She wouldn't listen to me. She Catherine wanted to dead. draw the soldier's gunfire. To make sure you escaped with the E-99 bomb. She was shot just as the ship started sinking. Catherine is dead. We cannot allow her sacrifice Luke. to be in vain. We must succeed and stop Demichev. Unfortunately, the bomb you found is not properly charged. You have to get to the cooker. It's part of the facility where there is or, I suppose I should say was, something we'll need. Do quickly, Captain. Demichev is closing in on us. Please, you should go. Okay. Well, Catherine Dine was entirely predictable as soon as she said she was going to draw their fire to protect me. So it's hard to feel that emotional about it. Okay, we're going to the cooker. We're going to get the chef to charge this bomb. There's always something, isn't it? You can never just pick up a bomb and it be charged and ready to go. You always have to do something to charge it. Just looking for secrets, looking for loot. And there isn't any. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why are the signs in English? This is Russia. I mean, I wouldn't complain normally, but they've done such a... Well, actually, no, they're in English and Russian. But again, this is a secret Russian facility. Why would they have signs in English? Doesn't make sense, but I guess it means you can actually, the game player can actually read them without having to go and take Russian in night school. After the singularity exploded, the service tunnels were used as a makeshift morgue for the dead and infected. Oh, nice. This won't be easy. Oh, nice. So we're going through a bunch of tunnels filled with dead bodies. Oh, dear. Okay, what do I want to augment? Uh, I got a perk, didn't I? That allowed me to get an extra piece of equipment. So I've got a sharpshooter, and I should, I presume, be able to buy something else. What was the other thing I wanted to buy? Oh, seek and destroy. Oh, maybe I have... Uh, sharpshooter. Search and destroy. Okay, that sounds good. 
That leaves me with 1900 to spend. I could increase my power of my deadlock. Or give myself more health. Uh, giving myself more health isn't the worst idea in the world. Just forge weapon upgrade kit. Can't afford the weapon upgrade kit. Uh, forge I've already got. Okay, more health I can't afford. So we'll go for a deadlock upgrade. So that I can freeze people for that little bit longer. Oh boy, phase ticks. I don't like phase ticks. Nice. Don't these people believe in burying their dead? I do. Okay. The imp can impulse them, but it does take a lot of uh, TMD energy, to be fair. It might be better off using bullets, although I'm kind of dying. <sighs> hmm. Not good. What's that? I can just phase. Uh, I can phase it, I can TMD that. I'm forgetting what all the words are. Oh. What excuse can I give for being a little bit disoriented this morning? Well, I. It's November the 24th. Yesterday was the day of the doctor. So I watched that. Oh, they got me from behind. Damn. Uh, it's like a lot of uh, recent Doctor Who. It doesn't really make sense if you stop and think about it for a minute. But it barrels forward with uh, so much energy that it's quite, really quite entertaining. And yeah, love the fan service. Not going to spoil it for anybody who hasn't seen it. But uh, you'll know when you see it. The two particular moments just made me go, whoa! And obviously, you know, I don't mean fan service in the way the uh, TV Tropes page uses the word. Hmm. Now there's a... I should be able to get in there, surely. There's, there's like a, an audio recording and all kinds of stuff. Why can't I get in? Wait, wait, wait. There's a broken window. If I stand on, if I crouch, now I'm, I'm stuck. I'm stuck on something. I can't get up on that radiator because wait, something was something. I just saw something. Well, the, yeah, that was TMDable. That's not going to help me get through the window, huh? There's a room there, there's recordings, there's law, there's... Oh wait, can I... Well, I can, I can grab that at a distance. But I can't listen to the recording at a distance. No, I, I don't want to miss out on that sweet, sweet law. I guess I'm going to have to, because it doesn't look like they can actually get into this room. You just do this juddering thing when you get close to the radiator. QA testers, oh dear. Damn, I really feel like I'm being down in the game this morning and I don't want to be. Because I like this game. I do, I guess that's the way your things are, isn't it? How funny do you, whoa, I died. That wasn't good. You often are, as I was saying, you often are down on most on the things you like because you want them to be awesome and you you want them not to have flaws and things. Uh, okay, I'm all the way back here. Let's shoot these dudes. Oops. After the singularity exploded, the service tunnels were used as a means of more for the dead and infected. This won't be easy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We're walking alive. Oh, it's hard to hit these things accurately. Okay, we reload, reload the. Oh, what? Where? Where? I didn't even see them. Where did they come from? I can hear the sound of things running into me, and I'm taking damage, and I don't know where they're coming from. Oh, there they are. Ah, oh, this is so not the appropriate weapon to be using here. 
pistol or something would be much better. But the game only lets me carry two weapons because, you know, I don't know why. Why, game? Why? If I spin this uh, the barrel, it means I can at least get shots off quicker, but uh, whole health back, I'm going to need that for certain. I hear you and I don't see you again. Why is it coming? Are they invisible? I mean, seriously, I keep taking damage and I don't see where they're coming from. Okay, here, here's some at least. So, if you, if you see them, at least I stand a chance, even though I'm an incredibly bad shot with this thing. Ah, oh, and spinning the barrel makes such a high pitched whining noise, it's actually hurting my ears. You see, there's this little delay when you, between you clicking and you starting to fire while the barrel spins up, and I was trying to avoid that. Alright, I can't. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't know. That was ammo. I thought I'd picked up the uh, tape recorder. Um, I mean, I can telekinesis this stuff. I still, I'm still angsting over missing that lore. No. Okay. Well, I said satisfy myself with some more delicious E99 and a health pack. Oh, health pack is just what I wanted. Right. Hmm. Okay, that was an effective use of the uh, impulse. Wow. Jeez Louise, how many of these things are there? How many of these? Now entering the E99 processing area. I'm sure Dimitrov's men won't risk going in there. Oh, great. Okay, what does this do? If there's one thing I've learned in games, if there's a lever, you should always press it to see what happens. Okay, tape recorder, so I'm not missing out on this law at least. I was leading a group of civilians to safety when we were attacked. I scared the creature away, but not before he got a good swipe. Ah, I'm bleeding pretty bad. Ah, that bastard is waiting for me, along with the mob of those crawling creatures. I'm out of ammo and so tired. I'll just rest here and wait them out. Dude's having a bad day by the sound of things. Hmm, which way am I going? Okay, so we need to do something about these things. I think you can shoot. Hmm, yep, you can shoot them. Or I could, uh, if it's something I could pick up, I could just lob it through. But I don't think there's anything to pick up around here. Hmm. Because obviously, you know, being an assault, Durenko cannot actually pick up anything, but he can use his telekinesis powers to grab things. Just can't use his hands. Yeah. Except for these glowing things. Those he can pick up quite normally. Whoa! My god, what's that? What was that? Mommy, I'm scared. Okay. Look at all the. Uh, ooh, what the. Ooh, my goodness, these guys are being impaled on trees and things. Corpses look fairly recent as well. These aren't from the 1950s. My god, what world is this? Uh oh, boy. Can I. Can I TMD him? That kind of okay. So the TMD uh, stuns. Oh my God! There's more than one of them. Ah, there's no grenades in this game. Why are there no grenades in this game? I need a rocket launcher, and I need it now. But I don't have one, so I'm just gonna have to settle for shooting him. Well, they do die. So, so they're not that tough. Okay. Just need to dodge these whatever they energy beams they're shooting at me. Oh, I'm so nearly dead. It's not even funny. Just empty my magazine into... Oh my god, is that another one behind him? Wait, what? Did I get... Did he catch me? Damn! Oh, at least the checkpoints were right back with the Barris off again. I was worried about that. That is 
one weird creature. He's got like seven tails. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to just start firing as soon as we see him and just keep firing. He died pretty quickly actually. Cool. There's another one behind him. Damn. Can we actually shoot him through the corpse of the other one? I guess this is mostly just timing, isn't it? You just need to time as you need to time it. I'm not sure my bullets are hitting him. I think they might be hitting the other guy. Alright, maybe we need to get closer. But yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, so it's mostly just a case of timing. Yeah, it, I just get into the rhythm that he's firing his uh, energy bolts off with and then just dodge. I know, God, I'm out of ammo. I killed him, thankfully. It was my last bullet I killed him. Ooh, weapons upgrade. That's going to be useful. Right, what, what else am I carrying? Sniper rifle, and that's it. Okay. Well, let's just hope there's some things I can snipe. Awesome ammo. That for the uh, for the According cannon. The GPS, you've exited the surface tunnels, which means you should be able to see the cooker. It's a massive spherical structure in the distance. Uh, that. To there, you'll have to repair the bridge, which means you'll need to activate the oh. amplification platform. There's always something. Look for the switch nearby. Here's what I don't get. If the TMD is a secret device, as it would be implied by the fact I discovered it in Barris of Secret Lab, why are the TMD amplification platforms everywhere on this island? Ouch. She's been there a while. Very well, well designed corpse, actually. Okay, I've got four 640 uh, E99 points. What do I want to put them into? I feel like I've, I keep buying that and it keep, and then it just says equipped and doesn't have a little star beside it. So I don't know what's going on there. Wait, I bought Deadlock before. Or was that the time I died? Huh. Okay, let's... Let's try buying both of these. That would explain why I had so many E99 points. I should have used dead luck in that fight against those dudes. Mm. I want some maximum health, I think, but I can't afford it. Maximum TMD energy would be kind of useful because I do, I do seem to not so much running out as I do keep finding cases where I'm having to stop and plug in a new cell. Okay, so it was just this loot up here. Well, it was just this upgrade point even up here. No loot, no ammo. Hmm, shame. I need ammo. I need my ammos. Yep, so up here. Okie dokie game. We're going up here. Oh, weapon locker. Ooh, uh... I should probably swap out the auto cannon for something that I've actually got, uh ammo for and there's some ammo in here. I love the way these weapon lockers just don't have any ammo. Okay, I have a weapon upgrade as well, don't I? Hmm. Again, this is the worst design thing of all time. Okay, that's my sniper rifle. Can I upgrade that at all? Where my clip size, I can increase the damage it does. That sounds like a good point thing to do. You want your sniper rifle to do lots of damage. Spike shot. Yep, let's equip that. I assume I've actually got weapons for it. Yeah. Does it do? That fires a spike. Oh, it fires an explosive spike. Okay. Interesting. Yep, guess there was something else up there I had to do. Oh, I had to pull the lever. As I as I said, if there's one thing I've learned from games, you pull levers. Oh, what? You mean that's not it? I have to do something else? 
games I, I think it's, a lot of games are designed like this and they give you some easy objective well not, well not easy objective but some objective and then they just keep putting uh, barriers in your way say oh you've got to do this oh you'll need a magic ring oh your magic ring isn't needs re-enchanting oh the re-enchanter was kidnapped by goblins and you have to go and rescue him oh the, go the goblins are uh, zombie goblins and they have to be dispelled by some magic spell you need to go and rescue the uh, disenchanting magic spell guy disenchanting magic spell guy exorcist actually you need to go and rescue the exorcist from where he was captured by the ghosts and so you've got all of these barriers and barriers upon barriers put in the way of you actually doing what you uh, need to do ah, death x launcher on the floor Do I take it that means I need to pick the Death X launcher up? Guess so. Um, yeah, I know what a Death X launcher is. It's a grenade launcher. I had one previously. I don't know. So the point of coming here was just to pick up the Death X launcher. Alrighty. Okay. Ah. Uh, can I grenade through the door? No. What? Wait, what? Game tells me I can go through the door. Game gives me no way of going through the door. I've been here before. <sighs> I was here in one of my previous videos in the same position. The game told me to do one thing and then didn't let me do it. And it turned out there was something else I had to do. Oh, I see. I've got to. I've got to throw grenades through there. <laughs> All right. So that's what the Death X launcher was for. Thank you for explaining that to me, game. Thank you. See, I wouldn't complain if it didn't actually have this feet feature, but it's supposed to tell you where to go. But because that's not reliable, I got a rage. You must be careful, Captain. What was getting closer? I, I don't know what he just said, and there was no subtitles, so I can't read it. I, have I used this spike launcher before? I can't remember if it's any good or not. I just needed something that I had ammo for, because I mean, I love the auto cannon, but I was just completely out of bullets. Okay. Okay, um, that way then, I guess. By process of elimination. We're climbing ladders. We're climbing ladders because this game doesn't have elevators. I like this space. Ooh, what have we here? Something we can de-age. Oh yes, we can de-age the lock to get into there. And ammo for something or other. Not sure what. Okay, so this raises the water level in there so I can get into wherever that is, I get. Ooh, wow. I I don't like the look of that. Okay, okay, we have a leak. Uh, I'm getting out of here. Feet, lead me. All right. So right now I'm wondering if maybe I should be have been putting points into my oxygen supply because I oh yep up there because I at the time last time I thought about it I was like I've never even used that. Why would I need it? Now I'm encountering quite a lot of underwater sections. I'm not actually sure. I'm going to run out of oxygen before I get to the end of this. All right. No, no, it's there. Phew. It would be cruel if the game designers had made it so that if you didn't decide to put points into your oxygen 20 minutes ago. Oh my god. That was scary. How grand you that. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, it would be cruel if the game designers made it so if you decided not to put points into your oxygen 20 minutes earlier, you now wouldn't be able to complete the game. Kind of thing that few game designers used to do in the 80s, when there was a whole swathe of completely unfair video games. Okay, that opened that. Where are these guys? They... Wait a minute, that guy's been hung. Did he... What the... What's going on here? They 
hang themselves while listening to whatever that music is. Oh, there's a tape recorder. Tell me law, tape recorder. I want to know what's going on. When the disaster struck, Elena and I ran to the safety of these tunnels. We made it just in time, but my leg was crushed by a partial cave-in. We waited for rescue, but none came. Elena left to search for medicine for me. But it was three days ago. She's not coming back. And I know I cannot go on without her. Oh, the shame. He couldn't go on without his lady love, so he's killed himself. Ah, it's Romeo and Juliet all over again. I'll be right back. <laughs> 